So when I was growing up, uh, this is a tradition that I have hung on to and now that I have my own family. Um, we, I grew up with a lot of kids and eight kids in my family. We eight? Did, eight kids. Wow. Yeah. We did not have a lot of money, so we appreciated what we had. Mm -hmm. and, and I don't know when it started, but I, I just, I never remember not doing it. Every Christmas morning we would wake up and before, you know, you have all the presents, you know, mm -hmm. and we're sitting around and you know how it is when you're a kid, everyone's anxious and antsy to open their gifts. Yes. But we couldn't do that until we said a prayer. Mm -hmm. And this is something that I remember my mom teaching me, who is so faithful. She's one of the most faithful women that I know. And she's, and that's something I want to carry into to my own home is the idea of always, always being grateful. Mm -hmm. No matter what we had, it pales into comparison to, to what we've been given from our mm -hmm. Heavenly Father, from mm -hmm. the Savior. And so we just expressed our gratitude. You know, so we, we do it now with my kids. They know every, it, it took a few years for them to get it, but they know we're not touching a single present until wow. we give thanks uh, wow. for what we have. And it's just really helped to, to keep that focus on Christ during this Christmas season. And That's it's a just great been, idea. It's an, an amazing tradition. Yeah.